Jesus said, I say to you, what things serve you desire when you pray, believe you receive them and you shall have them. You can receive any kind of miracle just like this. Any need met, any bill paid, you can be healed from a so-called incurable terminal disease with this right here. But, verse 25 says, verse 25, can you go to the next verse? And, when you stand praying, do what? Forgive, and. And means he wasn't through talking. Right? Whatever it is you need, whatever you, you desire, when you pray, believe you receive it, you'll have it. And, and, when you stand praying, forgive. If you have anything against anybody, that your Father, which is in heaven, may forgive you your trespasses. Verse 26, if you... If you don't forgive, your father won't, won't be able to forgive you. You're not receiving it. It's no coincidence that there is a, a virus plague going around the world at the same time that there is strife and hatred in the streets. This is the enemy playing us. When I say us, I'm talking about the country. I'm talking about, I'm talking about the world. If you want to receive your healing, you must forgive. Come on, is anybody listening? If you want to, you know, get a good job, you must forgive. If you want to get your bills paid and come out, get your needs met, you must. Somebody say must, must, must. And it doesn't matter the direction that you're talking about. It doesn't matter what people have done to you. You might say, yeah, but what they've done is, is unforgivable, not to God. And they, they need to pay for what they did. The Lord said, vengeance is mine. Is that right or not? Thank God you and I can be completely free if we'll make the choice to be. You cannot hate Republicans or Democrats. You cannot hate the President or Nancy Pelosi. Come on, are you listening? You cannot hate light-skinned people or dark-skinned people. You just, you just can't do it if your faith is going to work. You know, it really is ignorance. Put up on the screen Acts 17, I guess it's 1726. Did I, say, did I get it right? See if that's it. Acts 1726, yeah. Thank you, Lord. Said, uh, the Lord has made of one blood all nations of men for to dwell on the face of the earth. One blood. Every human being came from Adam and Eve. And if you're light-skinned, how many dark-skinned people are in your family tree? Quite a few. You don't know. If you're dark-skinned, how many light-skinned people are in your family tree? I assure you, quite a few. So if you hate the opposite shade, you really hate yourself. Huh? And if you want that shade to pay, well, you really should pay yourself. Because that's in you too. But if you want your faith to work, come on, somebody help me out. If you want your faith to work, you make the choice, I forgive. And if you want to make the enemy really angry, you do what Jesus said, you pray for those that hate you and despitefully use you. Man, you want to really rock the boat this is what you do. You lift them up before the Lord. You say, Lord, I ask you to send laborers across their path. I ask you to open their eyes. I ask you to give them repentance. I ask you to have mercy. You, you talk about sending ripples throughout the spirit realm. Every time the enemy keeps pushing you, pushing you, 
trying to make you angry, trying to make you upset, bringing that thing to your mind a thousand times. See, that's the enemy. That's the devil. If you'll cast it down, command it to leave you, and say, you know what? Watch this, devil. That person I'm so upset about, Lord, I'm lifting them up to you. (laughs) I'm asking you to have mercy on them. I'm asking you to send labors. Can you do that right now? Everybody said, I I lift up those that have been against me. Those that have hurt me. Those that hate me and despise me. And I ask for mercy. Send laborers across their path. Open their eyes. Give them repentance to the acknowledging of the truth. I ask it in Jesus' name. Oh, hallelujah. Lift up your hands. Lift up your hands. Say, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Oh, I bless that wonderful name. Oh, bless that wonderful name. Healing for the country. Healing. Oh, there is healing in the name of Jesus. No other name do I know. The enemy is very tricky. These spirits are very persuasive. If you watch and listen to the wrong thing, you can get sucked in. Next thing you know, you're full of hate. Next thing you know, you're just fuming. You're mad. You want to hurt somebody. How many understand? This is the devil. That's the devil. Resist it. Somebody say resist it. Resist it. Stop watching it. Stop listening to it. Resist it. We are Christians like the Christ. I mean, when they nailed him to the cross, nailed him physically, spit on him, mocked him, hit him, what did he say? Father, forgive them. They don't know what they're doing. Is that your example? Come on, somebody said, that's my example. That's my example. Vengeance is not mine. It belongs to the Lord. It's not for me to make anybody pay. I forgive, and I am forgiven. And my faith works. My faith works. My faith works. My faith works. And whatever I ask, I receive of Him. Oh, somebody say, thank you, Lord. Sing it another time. Oh, I bless that wonderful name. Oh, I bless that wonderful name. Oh, I bless that bless that wonderful name. Just lift your hands. Let the Holy Spirit just wash over you. Let Him take away all the anxiety, all the fear, all the worry, and let the hate go away from you. Say it out loud, I'm not a hater. I'm a Christian. I don't hold grudges. I forgive, even as God for Christ's sake, has forgiven me. I'm not hard-hearted. I'm tender-hearted, forgiving others. 
Oh, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Oh, the Spirit of God's working on people here and watching by internet. There's people all over the place. Come on, let that junk go. Let it go. You can't control everybody. You can't control what they think and do. But you can control yourself. Oh, thank you, Lord. Say there's healing in the name. There's healing in the name. Healing, healing, healing. in the name thank God there's forgiveness in the name there's forgiveness in the name Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father, that the love of God is shed abroad in our hearts by the Holy Spirit. And we are free from hate. Oh, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I refuse to hate. I refuse to harbor ill will. I refuse to agree and yield to the accuser of the brethren. I, I refuse to try to force people to do things. You don't do that. I refuse to yield to the enemy. Now, if you've done that, just close your eyes. If you've done that and you've got symptoms of any kind in your body, if you've really forgiven, faith works by love and you're ready to receive. If you yield to God and submit yourself to God, you can resist the devil and he has to flee. If you got any kind of symptoms in your body, I want you to talk to it right now and say symptoms, problems, weakness, pain, leave me. I'm walking in love. I'm submitted to God. I'm listening to God. And devil, you have to listen to me. Go in Jesus' name. Oh, oh, oh. Infection. Anything that ought not be there, go. Leave. Stop in Jesus' name. Oh, hallelujah. Somebody say, I'm walking in love. I'm forgiving others. I hold no grudge. Whoa, I'm free. Free. Oh, so free. Thank you, Master, for forgiving me. Oh, come on, just lift your hands up. Worship the Lord. Praise the Lord. Give glory to God. I worship you, Father. I worship you, Lord. I give you all the glory. Thank you, Lord. 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 Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Hallelujah. 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 Oh, thank you, thank you. 
you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Hallelujah. I'm not just wasting your time, saints. If you harbor unforgiveness, it'll stand in the way of your healing. It'll stand in the way of you getting your bills paid. It'll stand in the way of you getting the job you need or getting your business going or whatever it is you need. You cannot, cannot have God forgive you of everything you've done and then you turn around and won't forgive somebody for something they did. He, he won't have it. So here's another opportunity. Besides that, it's, so, it's such an unhappy life, being mad all the time. It just really rains on everybody's parade that you go around. Just, it really makes you a wet blanket. <laughs> you, don't, you don't want people to dread seeing you come, right? Because you always got a scowl on your face. You're always mad because of all the problems in the world. Friend, there's always been problems in the world. There's always going to be problems in the world. And you can stay miserable your whole life. One thing after another. Or, or, you can cast all your cares over on the Lord. You can forgive everybody of everything. And you can receive like a river flowing from the throne of God. Somebody say, I receive. I receive. I receive. I receive. Oh, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. There's freedom. There's freedom in the name. Lord, we worship you in these places tonight. We, we present ourselves before you. Help us to get rid of any wrong thinking, wrong believing. Enlighten any darkness that we've had. Illuminate our understanding. Help us to get free from ignorance. Any lies and deception that we've been influenced by, identify them. Help us to, to get free of them. And we purpose to walk in the light as you are the light. Hallelujah. And we thank you that the path you got planned for us gets brighter and brighter. 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 